Hello you lovely people, welcome back to my channel for a very different video guys. This is actually not really game related, although I'm going to talk about a game guys because this was another fantastic early birthday present that I got yesterday. It's my birthday tomorrow but this came yesterday guys and it's an absolute doozy. Thank you Steve Mahoney for this present. Oh me and Oliver are absolutely loving it already fella. Oh, it's absolutely stellar, guys. Now, if you've been watching my channel for a while, you may have seen my PS1 review and play on of the virtual amazing sea monkeys or whatever the bloody hell. Here we go. That one, yeah? It is not a good game, guys. I tell you what, it is not a good game by a long stretch of the imagination. It's god awful. But... The product it's based on, guys, is fantastic. Oh, the, the the sea monkeys are just awesome. They are fantastic little, almost like a scientific experiment in a way, that gets you a pet at the end of it. Now, I knew that Oliver was going to love this, guys. As soon as that came out of the box, when it got delivered, guys, and I opened it up and I saw what it was, I knew that Steve had hit it on the, oh, the nail on the head, guys, for me and Oliver. It is absolutely awesome, guys. It is the live sea monkeys or oh, the aquarium. Um, oh, brilliant, 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 guys. Now, there's lots of different ones of these, as you can see, flashing up. Now, there are tons of different variations of the tank. The one we've got is your standard tank, guys, that you can get in Argos, for instance. But, oh, my word, are they awesome. Because it shows the life cycle of a creature from literal birth from an egg. Oh, and then you trying to keep it alive, of course. And, uh, yeah, and it can go on forever, guys, as I've said before. It can go on forever because they just keep spawning more of them, of course, because they, you know, they have their nuptials and then they make babies so they can just keep going and going. Even when the older ones die, you'll have the younger ones to take over. As long as you look after it and follow the instructions properly, you'll be all right. Now, Sea monkeys have been around for a long time, guys, since 1957, when Harold von Braunhut actually brought them to the market in uh, North America, guys. He brought them to the market. Of course, they are based on a brine shrimp, and um, but it's a very different kind of brine shrimp. It's not your usual, and the reason they're called sea monkeys, guys, is because of the long tail that they have. So I'll show you some pictures of the real thing. Uh, there we go, and then you can see how they don't look like little humans. They don't build little houses, drive little cars, and uh, run businesses in their tank. No. That was always a bit of a false advertising, guys. Done on purpose, and it bloody worked. Because Harold managed to sell gazillions of the bloody things through putting adverts like this one, guys, into comic books at the time. Um, yeah, all the comic books guys were running these adverts and it gave people a false sense of what they were going to get. Although, brilliant marketing. Oh my word, was it brilliant marketing, guys. And it really, really did work. So let's face it, they were brought out in 57 and you can still purchase them to this day. So what a fantastic thing, guys. It runs along with your ant farms and all that, guys. Uh, kids love flipping sea monkeys. And so do adults like me, because like I've said many times before, guys, I've had them when I was a child. And also a lot of my children had them when they were growing up as well, guys. And they are just fantastic. And you're probably thinking to yourself, um, you know, well, if they can go on forever, where are they now? Well, yeah, very true, guys. Very, very true. Um, for whatever reasons at the time, maybe they didn't work out in the end or maybe they just died. Or maybe we threw the water away a bit too bloody early thinking it hadn't worked because that is one of the things you can make a big mistake with with these guys. They are so tiny. You just think about it, guys, right? When they first appear, when they first hatch, guys, um, they are no bigger than a full stop in a sentence, guys. You look at how big a full stop is. That is how big they're going to be. They're like a speck almost, guys. 
Um, so you can make that mistake. And probably early on when I was a kid, I probably made that mistake. For oh my God, there's nothing happening. And I poured the water down the toilet or something. And actually, they were just so tiny, you can't see them. You've got to give it five days and then you start feeding them. And that's when they start getting bigger. And yes, in the end, guys, you do see them playing with each other. They become full sized and they're about ooh, that. And uh, yeah, you can see them playing with each other, which is fantastic. And of course, then they start to mate and they make babies and it can just go on and on and on. Every now and then you have to top up the water because, of course, the first stage, which is what we're going to look at in this episode, guys, is water purification. So basically you put the water in the tank and you purify it. Um, and over time, obviously... You can't just keep adding tap water to it because that would be defeating the object of it and they'll die. Um, you've got to use bottled water that is at room temperature. So leave a bottled water out for a little bit, get it nicely to room temperature and then you can top it up that way. That is a safe way of doing it. So yes, guys, in part one, I'm going to grab Oliver. We're going to uh, open it up, show you the contents of your standard kit, guys. And uh, then Oliver's going to fill it up. He's going to put the water purification pouch in. And that'll be part one done and dusted. And then you give it a little stir and then you put it in a window somewhere and leave it for 24 hours. So tomorrow we'll do the second part where we put in the eggs. That's going to be fantastic. And I tell you what, oh, it's so brilliant, guys. In no time they will start to hatch, even though you won't realise it because they're so freaking tiny. That is why on the tanks, guys, you have all the, uh, what are basically magnifying little uh, round parts on the tank. So you can watch them uh, as they grow up. You can watch them going past there. And uh, yeah, as they get bigger and bigger, you probably don't need them so much because you can see them with your physical eye and all that. All right. Would you like to join me for part one, guys, as we take a look? Oh, as we take a look, as we do it, guys, we do it, me and Oliver. Get the first part of our sea monkeys ready and done and dusted, guys. Right, back in a sec with all of that. Me. Right, here we go, guys. This is going to be the first part, too many, I'm sure, of the sea monkeys. Yes. So, yeah, in this one, Oliver, what are we going to do? I'm going to snip. You're going to snip those bits out and we're going to see what you get. Yeah, see what you get in the kit, guys. So, right, here we go. Here's me trusty, dusty scissors. Let's go in here. You know, you can cut your fingers off. Yeah, you could, couldn't you? There we go. That's that snipped. And I think we can just pull it out now. There we go. So, right. Now we've, now we've opened it. Let's have a look at it. So, there we go, guys. As you know, we see monkeys, I'm sure. They always have very, uh, yeah, elaborated uh, descriptions in uh, images of what they're going to look like. They are not little people. They do not build towns and drive cars and own schools and supermarkets. That yeah, just those. isn't real. Yeah, there's the real ones, guys, on the side here. Yeah, yeah. yeah that's what they really look like. And, uh, yeah, they're basically, they're a type of shrimp. That was around already. Arthropod. Yeah, arthropod. They were around already in the dinosaur days. So there's a little bit of a basic instruction there. Obviously you get the full book inside. But these have not changed at all really. Even from when I was little and had my first kit of the sea monkeys. It's not really changed the little tank at all. Obviously you can get more elaborate setups but this is your basic one. Yes, you, right, can, so, you could get like a fish tank if you wanted Yeah, you to. can even get like a, a big old racing thing at one time. Back in the 70s, you could get like where they raced each other. It was really cool. Oh, right. Yeah, I've shown that in my Sea Monkeys video that I did of the PS1 game, which is not good. Mm. Um. But the Sea Monkeys are cool. So right, here we go then, Oliver. Let's open it up and I'll hand the bits to you. So Hopefully there's... the real ones are actually good. Yeah, that's it. And they just won't die. There's your, there's your top. Yes. Right, so we'll put that aside a the minute. Top. <laughs> right, so what have we got in here then? The instructions. That's right the instructions. Right, do you want to hold them a minute? Right, so let's open them up. You can hold one side, I'll hold the other. Let's open it up first. 
So we'll have to have a good read of this, won't we? Even though I've done it many times before. We'll read it again. There we go. You hold one side, look. Make sure it's straight. So there you go, guys. Yeah, there's your, uh, all your instructions of what to do. Move it down. There we go. All of us hold on one side. Yeah, that's it. Spin it around. And there's even more there. You holding it again? Yeah. The original Sea Monkey's warranty. Wow. Sea Monkey. Yeah. So yeah, there you go, guys. That's your uh, instruction book, if you like, okay. instruction sheet. Right. Let's put that aside as well. A minute. What else do we get here? Right. So what does that say, Oliver? Growth food. Growth food, that's stage three. Right, let's move Where this back a bit so we can say? actually show people what's here. So yeah, growth food, that is stage yep. three. Yeah. So we've got two more stages before that. Oh look, stage two, what's that? Uh, instant live eggs. Live eggs. Oh, live eggs. Yeah, that is actually the sea monkeys. That's the little pouch with their oh. eggs in. Number two. There. Yeah, and then we have one more. I bet it's going to be the purifier. Yeah, what does that say? Water purifier. Yeah, stage one water I purifier. So yeah, they're the three pouches, guys. So yeah, first of all, you have to purify the water. So you fill the tank up with water, and then you put that in. That's what we're going to do in the next video, and Oliver's going to do that. Then, yes. after 24 hours, you put the eggs in. And they uh, almost immediately start to uh, hatch. But you can't feed them for five days. And that's when pouch three comes in. Yes. And you feed them. Right, there's one more thing in here. There should be one more thing in here, he says. Let's tip it out. There oh, is a little a spoon. spoon. Yeah, and that is going to be the food spoon. That's what you put the, oh, the food in with. There's yeah. something on it. Like it's right got a little here. sea monkey on it, has it? Yeah, yeah the sea that's, monkey. Yeah. That's kind of cool, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. You then in the bottom, look at that, Ollie. Look the in the seat. bottom. It's got like a little little ground thing where it yeah. looks like it's got like a little crater and stuff yeah. in the bottom. Let's it looks take like the ice. let's take this out a minute, and then you can see it properly. Oh, so yeah. that's a tank. Yeah, it's a tank. Oh. Right, so just adjust that again. There we go, guys. There's your the thing that was in there. Hope you can see that better now. There we go. With that very, uh, yeah, not realistic uh, icons there. But it's just. Yeah, they, they'll definitely hatch into that. Mm. <laughs> yeah. But it just kind of goes with the sea monkeys these days. Of course, back in the 70s, all the comics used to have the adverts, which looked like this, in them. And that's how they sold millions and millions of sea monkey kits, because people actually thought they were going to get that. But they weren't, of course. They were dreaming. Right. Yeah, we're Pull just going to get an arthropod. Now you can see in the bottom, guys. Look, it's like, yeah, like a little crater. And mm. yeah, looks pretty damn cool. Look yes. at that. There we go. So, yes, guys, the next stage will be Oliver putting some water in it yes. and putting a water purifier in. So, we'll be back in a sec. Yeah. Right, Ollie, are you ready for this? Yes. The part where we put the water in, guys. So we've got a jug ready here. Oliver's got to fill up the tank. Right, remember, Oliver, don't go over those holes there, right? Yeah, and I'll hold the, this for you while you pour it in. I'll tell you when to stop. So keep going. Keep going, keep going. Might, you might need some more water, might we? That's it, keep going. Watch you don't go over the edge, that's it. Good lad, keep going. That's it, brilliant. Keep going. Yeah, you can get more in. I'll tell you when to stop. Keep going. Yeah, you're going to need to touch them all. Right, so stay tight a minute, give me that. That's it, give it a There we go. Right, let's get a bit more. Right, there we go, guys. Tiny, 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 tiny little bit more. Yeah, go on in. Tiny bit more. That's what you think tiny yeah. is. That's it. Stop, stop, stop. Oh, there we go. I might even have gone a little bit too far. Right, let's just take a tiny bit out again. 
I knew something might have gone wrong. Yeah, right, well, here we go. I've, I've taken too much out now. Can't win, guys, can't win. Right, let's put a tiny bit more back in. There we go. That'll do. Right, okay. Yep, that's perfect. That's perfect, yeah. So what we've got to do now, Ollie? We've got to put the water purifier in, haven't we? Yeah, so, yeah, that's pouch one, guys. There we are. Pouch one. Pouch one. Right, let's just tap oh, it and make sure everything goes there. down. There we go. Right, so I'll rip it open, yeah? This is for one Made in the USA, just like Nate. Right. He made it. Yeah, he made it. Yeah, he didn't make it, but he's been made in the USA, that's for sure. Right, okay, let's take the top off. He's been made in the USA. Right, so there we go, guys, taking it off. Let's get the pouch ready for Oliver to pour it. Right, here Wait, we go. do I pour all of it? Yeah, you pour the whole lot in and then we've got to stir it. So we've got to get the spoon Ooh. ready as well. So here we go with the old yeah. spoon. Right, so are you ready for this, Oliver? Take it. And pour the whole lot in there. That's it. That's it. Is it all in? Yep. Yeah, cool. All right. That's good then, right. And then you get the spoon and you just stir it gently. You might get your fingers wet a bit. Go on. You go for it. That's it. Just stir it gently. There we go. I don't care if my fingers get wet. Yeah, you don't care, eh? Right? You don't care. Yeah, it's just going to be a yeah. little cold. All right. That's it, he's having a good stir. You like stirring it up, Oliver, don't you? Yeah, like mm. it's kind of like a cup of tea. Yeah, a cup of tea. Would you like a cup of tea, sir? Right, okay, that should do. Right, pass me the spoon, look. Hey, there we go. We need that for the food later, don't we? So now you've got to put that on, haven't you? Put that on top. There we go. You know how to do it, you got it? Then we wait some days. Yeah, then we have to wait 24 hours, that's all. <laughs> 24 hours and Only then... one day. Then we're going to end up adding pouch two, which is the actual sea monkeys. Yeah. The eggs. So yeah, now we've got to stand it in the uh, window, guys. So we're going to stand it in our kitchen window where the sun reaches it nicely. So I will move that over. So there we go, guys. That is part one. Are you excited, Oliver? Mm -hmm. Did you enjoy part yes. one? That was already quite cool, wasn't I it? I really want to see the I know, I know. We're going to have to be a bit patient, aren't we? Yeah. So everything goes right. Right, so that is part one, guys. I hope you enjoyed this. Oliver did, didn't you? You enjoyed it, yeah. Yes. So you know what to do, guys. Drop us a sub. If you haven't subbed already, give me a funny thumbs up. And, of course, tap the bell icon to get any future Thanks. notifications. Like the that's next... So fun yeah, to that's watch. it. Yeah, thumbs up like that like the next parts to this series right we're going to say bye bye ollie bye also subscribe yeah so you got it from the horse's Ollie. mouth there yeah right okay guys we'll see you in the next part bye bye bye